Hello fans, welcome to my channel. My name is Peter Kelvin. I am an architect by, by profession. Welcome to my channel. Uh, this video was a request on how to export your project from ArchCAD to Atlantis. Some of the basic and some tips and some tips that you must follow for you to successfully export your work from ArchCAD to Atlantis. So if you are new to my channel, uh, please uh, remember to like subscribe share and uh, remember to ring the bell for you to get notification every time i upload a new video so uh i'm going to open my archicad file i have it here i'm going to click here now this is my work it is a project i'm doing it is a machinate with a girl floor and fast floor i'm going to demonstrate using this project uh, so before i show you how to export you first of all you have to understand that Atlantis is a 3D software, meaning it only understands 3D language. So if you try to export your project in 2D form the way I have opened it on my window, it's, it's not going to be exported because it is not in 3D. So for you to export your project, first of all you must have your project opened in 3D. So I'm going to open my project in, in 3D by clicking here. Now I have my project open in 3D. I'm going to open it a little for you to see it. I'm still working on this project. I'm going to open it, you can get inside and see. Look, I'm still working on it. And you can move around my design. You can move. You can move around my work and see. Still, still working on it. It's not yet complete. You can pick any view that you want to export with. But for now, I'm going to use this front view. Uh, the way it is, I'm, I'm okay with that one. So I'm going to close my orbit. Now we are going to export our, our work the way it is. So for you to export your work, you come here at File. Then look for Save As is here. Then click Add Save As. It's going to pop this important small window here with two important important option first is file name rather the other one is save as type here here at file name you give your project a name for now i'm going to name my project sample zero one then for here then here you have option save as type if you see here you have your attorneys studio is active if i click here you are going to see other option like a uh, line of 3d Lumion, SketchUp, Filmotion, Atlantis 6. But for now, we are going to choose our Atlantis version 5 because that's what I'm going to demonstrate using. Uh, if I click here, then, uh, then I'm going to save my work on desktop. You can save your work anywhere you, anywhere you want. Maybe if you have a folder where you save your work, you can save your work there. But for now, I'm going to save my work on desktop by clicking here desktop then i'm going to save it's going to pop this important small window here name atlantis now uh, sometimes you might export your work and find out that some of these blocks they are they are not checked maybe you have, maybe you have export you have exported your work and maybe your slab or your sun is not checked so please make sure that before you export confirm that all these ticks all these blocks they are checked Okay, before you export, make sure they are all checked. So if if you have confirmed they are all checked, then you can go ahead and click here to export. It's going to rotate. It's going to export for some minutes. Now it's done. Then uh, I'm going to close my win my archicad window by clicking here. Then I'm going to look for my project. My project is here, sample zero one. I'm going to double click to open it. I'll give it some second. It's opening. I'm going to give, give you to maximize this opening and bingo we made it we successfully export our project from archicad to atlantis so uh basically that's how simple you export your work from archicad to atlantis so uh go ahead and try it yourself and you're going to make it and uh, remember to like my video uh subscribe to my channel share and uh, remember to ring the bell for you to get notification every time i upload a new video so thank you so much and uh, have a nice time